Scorpio, welcome to your weekly forecast. Now this is for June 23rd until 29th. Let's take a look. What's going to be coming your way? All right, Scorpio looks like you are hmm, feeling a bit of a jealous, you know, this week and you feel like your partner is doing something, especially if you're with an air or earth signs. Um, it seems like you are under the suspicion that your partner has been doing something right behind you and you feel like that they are hiding something from you as well their activities their times and sometimes they just you know vanish or they just come home late or even if they will say that they are at work and when you pay them a visit they are not really at work but they are in some place else um the thing here is i don't feel like that there is a third party but your partner is hiding something from you which is because they don't want you to get hurt or they don't want you to worry about them it's not that easy for your partner to accept whatever it is that they are going through but they just want to keep it to themselves for now okay so rest assured that there is no third party and that they are not philandering or going for you know like a sex capade someplace else it's not the case but i feel like there is also some medical stuff you know that you um you will be discovering later on so and not to mention that your partner, especially if you're not yet married, your partner is also waiting for you to propose or to, you know, put a ring on it. And it seems like at this point, they're still in the waiting game. And they don't even know if they should, you know, how long they should still wait or how long they could still, you know, like, um, stay like this. Now, if you're with an earth sign right now, it looks like this earth sign is going away for a little, for a little while, for a, you know, for a trip or to go and be by themselves for a little while. And if you are with an air sign, it looks like this person is also taking a trip someplace else to attend a wedding. Now, you, on the other hand, you will feel a little bit um, suspicious about your partner's activities and you will be you will try to you know to follow them or to you know yeah to dig up whatever it is that they are hiding from you and you'll be surprised that it is not actually a third party but it is like a medical condition that they are trying to resolve on their own so and then you will be um you know turning to your family for an advice which is you don't want to entertain the idea and you don't want to think of it as uh, something that is, you know, uh, something that is dangerous or something that is life causing. But uh, you just want to take it easy and think that this is just like a, you know, like a normal med medical thing that they are going through. It could be like a Botox or dermatological, you know, vanity related thing. <coughs> <clears throat> but the truth is you're actually afraid of knowing the truth because it is more than that so this week right in the middle of the week right after discovering whatever you will be discovering 
you will try to treat your partner as like an equal and it seems like you will also be courting each other or you will be wooing your partner and this will give them like a very big surprise and they will be you know, they will find you so weird okay of course that your partner is not you know not stupid so they will have a hint that you already know what's going on and instead of opening up to you they will be inching themselves away from you or they will be moving away from you for a little while and this will just cause another friction or tension in your relationship that both of you are not really facing the truth and both of you are not really facing you know the things that it's if you should be confronting and this will just cause another rift in your relationship for you your partner is pushing you away and kicking you outside the door and for your partner you're so worried and you don't really want to hear you know the um the pity and you know the um the drama and uh, they just want to contain this on their own so i mean to help the situation you know especially if you've already discovered what they are really up to it would actually help out more if you would just pretend that you don't know anything and not really act too weird about it so that it will curb down more damages later on and for them not to move away from you and um because the thing about you is when you actually know something or when you found out something it's so hard for you to keep a secret you're secretive and non-secretive both at the same time so if you don't want your partner to move away further away from you then i feel like just pretend that you don't know anything at all and keep on observing okay um but on the other hand if you will because I don't really see any betrayal or heartbreak, but it seems like your partner is really hiding something from you. So, uh, you know, I can't really say that there is something that you're that you should be worried about, or that there is a threat to your marriage or relationship. Anyway, there is a fire sign that will be betraying you for money, so be very careful about this. And you also need to hone down your, you know, you need to hone your instinct and your intuition more because it seems like there is someone who is trying to rebuild or is trying to build their own fence or to build their own foundation right behind you using your own resources now and uh, money will be coming to you and you will be attending two major conferences or two major events this week or you'll be getting an invitation okay now you will also be talking to your boss or you will also be talking to oh, well, either this is legal or um, it's not medical but legal or bank um, bank agency or bank institution and it seems like you will be either remortgaging or asking for refinancing which is you don't actually you don't even need this because the finances it you know it will come secure and you don't really have to add up another debt now because of the um you know depressive situation that the two of you that are in right now one of you wants to walk away and the other one is too brokenhearted and wants to be isolated for a little while and both of you will just try and be and be um you know uh, strong and civil towards one another but you will also be acting a little bit indifferent you feel like your partner has been alienating you and your partner feels like i can t take care of this they're a very strong person but it's also hard because there are some situations in their life that they cannot really accept or it's going to take time for them to accept all that's going to take, you know, it, it will reach up to the point where you will be busting them with whatever you know. And because of that, that there will be some tears that will be, you know, running through. But uh, eventually, you will resolve this naysays and um, 
you know, like um, suspicions or doubts that's inside of you, and it will get cleared out. Okay, don't worry, things will start getting better, and I feel like that there's still hope. Okay, all of us will be going through these rough patches and obstacles in our lives, and there is no perfect relationship. All right, and this is just for this week. Don't worry, it's not even for a month. It's only for this week. Who knows that by next week, your week will be much, much better than this. All right. Anyway, that's it for you for this week, Scorpio. If you want to talk to me live on the phone and live on the calls, just go visit me at my website, and sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.